Welcome, welcome, welcome. It is a super exciting day for me. Here is my brand new Emilonga. Uh, brand new, by brand new I mean brand new to me. I literally just got it home and swapped it all out into the bassinet mode. Put the hood on it because the hood changes from the bassinet to the pram seat. It has the swivel wheels at the front. I believe it's like the nitro version. Um, I really don't have a lot of knowledge on these prams. So I will do a full review on it once I tie it up. But this is pretty much just a welcome video. You can see all the stains. So I'm going to pull all this off and wash it all. Um, it's got the two mattresses. So she said that she bought this one as an extra because the one that came with it wasn't enough. Which it doesn't look enough. <laughs> um, then you've got your base down there. Uh, this leatherette, I'm going to pull it all off and give it a wash, but it's quite beautiful. I love it, but I don't, I don't know how I feel about it. It's so pretty and it's white leatherette. It's more cream leatherette. It also has a seat, so let's grab that quickly. So here is the seat. It is quite a low pram. You'll notice it does sit quite low, but it is a big seated pram, so there's a lot of room in there. You can recline it pretty much flat. Uh, with I just it's all old school like this is the leather to recline it it's strange there is a seat fully reclined so it does like I said like flat and it does look like it's got a bit of padding in there I don't know I like the harness it's quite easy to do up but again it's the older style I'm going to have to see what I'm going to do with this we've got some cracks I know you can get a whatever, like a polish kind of thing. But yeah, either way, it needs to all come off and be cleaned. Wipe it all down. You can see a bit of dirt in there. And then I will take it out and I'll decide if I like it or not. <laughs> but a part of my channel is that I do pram reviews on different prams. So here is an Emelonga in the white cream leatherette. I believe it's a nitro. Today the fun starts. Just here there was some marks, some a big dirty mark there. So I've got some leather cleaning wipes. I'm just wiping it and hopefully get all the marks off. The straps are a little bit dirty. So I'll go over them. I've chucked the liner in the bath and the mattresses in the bath to soak. But the liner actually has the leather on the outside, so we're a little bit worried about that. I'm not sure if I'm gonna go and get a leather filler or if I'm just gonna wipe them over, but that's pretty nasty, so I'll have to see what I'm gonna do there. Mattress <coughs> protector cover thingy, that's net sheet <laughs> on the line. I've got both of the mattresses on the line because it had the two, so this is the original Emma one, <coughs> I believe, um, and it's almost dry pretty much we hung it and it was um, downwards and all of the water ran to this side so it's almost finished and then this is the really thick mattress that still has water coming out of it I just ring wrung the bottom of it out some great news though I was told <laughs> that if I got another pram that there would be nowhere to put it and I had to get rid of one but you know what I found a spot. <laughs> I cannot get to the cupboard anymore, but prams have wheels so you can move them to get to the cupboard. I have now got five prams in one room, which is absolutely ridiculous. And I've also learned if you leave something in the back room long enough when the parents are painting, so this all got painted, so we had to move all of this, we're still painting. If you leave something there for long enough, they will actually make room for it. <laughs> There's even like a little suitcase down the bottom and it fits in with mum's antique collection. I've put um, this little teddy bear and the rattle was already in it. And <laughs> mum put her doll now on. If I said Emma, I mean my Emma longer. But my Emma has a bassinet and a seat. So yeah, that's fine. I found somewhere for the pram um, chassis to go, the pram frame. Now I need to find somewhere for the bassinet to go or the seat to go when it's not on the frame. I have a massive dilemma. I feel like I should get rid of the cot, but then I don't have like 
a cute little place to take photos of them. <laughs> I could probably get a bassinet, which would take up like that much room. And then like I could have like another two prams here. Ugh, why do I have so many prams? I need them. I'm not selling the bug. I love the way it pushes and I love the way it looks, especially with the bassy. So that's not going. This is my new love, the Velcro Snap Ultra. It pushes so well, it folds up really cool because the seat can stay on this way. And however lightweight it is, you can't tip it. Like I'm leaning on this and it doesn't tip. The Strider, I kind of want to sell it, but I won't because it's so handy. It's such a common pram that it's good for pram letter photos and it's also handy with the capsule. I can do tips and trick videos with the Strider pram because something always comes up like I've just done. The Mima, I won't get another one the same. It is a white pram with a black frame. It's absolutely ridiculously cool. It's just designed weird and cool and i just found the little girl that i just bought the reborn that will fit in the seat now so that's not going the emma i really like it but i don't like that it's old school so like some parts on it the hood isn't huge these straps really bother me up here these come from the top of the pram can you see that up there which is ridiculous so when you put the baby's straps on like this, they come from right at the top. Like how annoying is that? So that's why the pad covers are all the way up there so that they weren't touching her head because I had her strapped in before. Like, that's just weird. Oops, sorry. I hate that. And I also hate the recline. It's like this little middle button. So the feather light, I love. It's just so unique. Like look how cool and bouncy that is. I just don't want it to hit the wall behind it. Oh, it just has to stay. It's it's so awesome. And I love that it sits here with that briefcase. It looks super cute. So they all, all of these prams are important to me. 